Never ever have I sucked two in one day. <laughs> Hi everybody. Hey. Hi. Hello. Hello. What do you all have in common? We're gay. We're gay. We're gay. <laughs> Hella gay. At least I am. There's gonna be four elimination rounds, and when we get to the final three people, the four people that got eliminated will decide who leaves with the thousand dollars. Should we just jump right into it? Let's do it. Sure. Does anyone wanna talk first? I can. All right. Yeah. Financially right now, not doing the best. Would love to use that money to move into my new apartment that I'm trying to get. I just got a new dog about two and a half months ago. Her name's Brittany. She's a little pit mix, but uh -huh. expensive. Well, my name's Rod. My biggest dream right now is to become a drag queen. It would benefit me a lot because drag is very expensive. I really want to take it seriously. Like I really want to make a career out of it. What is your drag name? Zyre Stardust. Zyre Stardust, okay. nice. One thing I do is I'm a choreographer. I actually own a dance studio. My demographic that I cater to is of course like kids of color. There's actually a dance convention coming up and three of the girls want to go. It's $245 a piece. If I got the money, that's exactly what I would do. I would pay for them to go. That's $900 right there. Maybe we can all go have drinks with the extra hundred. <laughs> my name's Scott. If I got the money, I'm currently getting my doctorate in social work. It would go towards tuition. I'm doing a capstone on LGBTQ plus suicidality though. So it's working on increasing gender affirming care access for, for trans people and gender non-conforming people. So nice. wow. yeah. Hi, a little about me is I have a dog named Topher. So both of us together is Christopher. Oh. 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 That's pretty cute. <laughs> I would use the money to splurge on my dog. I would use it towards uh, my medical bills. I have actually a lot right now, and one main one I'm trying to complete paying off is uh, a $7,000 one, and it was due to mental health. I'm Noah. I'm fortunate enough to be able to pay my bills, so if I get the money, I'll just give it to charity to the Trevor Project or something, or Lambert House, which help LGBT youth who end up being homeless. All the issues that those people are facing are probably more than, you know, anything any of us face. So I don't have a sob story, sorry. <laughs> Do you think someone here gave a sob story? Uh, what he said about you know uh, kids not having access in general, that's obviously unfortunate. And the reason why I think that's like the bigger sob story is because it's not like one person sob story, you know, or you mm -hmm. know like one dog or one person or etc. It's like a bigger issue. So it's a bigger sob story in my mind. Poor dog, I love you. Yeah. Dog. Okay, no, yeah. I'm sure you're not dog. <laughs> Just so y'all know, I love y'all dog. So are you trying to say that you think people need to have a sob story to win? No, that's exactly what I said I don't want to do. That's why I was like, I just want to put that to the side that, you know, I don't have a sob story that I'll just give the money to charity, whatever. Discuss how you want to decide who gets eliminated this first time. Should we do voting? Yeah. Before we vote, I want to say that we're all worthy of this money, no matter yes, who has a stronger story or not. I think we're all worthy yes, of this. So nice. no hard feelings to no one, whoever we all vote for. Period. Oh, wait, are we even voting? Yeah. Damn, I just said I think we should just vote on who, it, at least in this realm, like who needs it the least. I would say, honestly, you, and I just right. say it because you, you're not really in financial like problems right now, so I'm sorry. Uh, okay. So you're voting against charity? Yes. I'm gonna vote oh. Noah as well. Okay. Noah. <laughs> All right. Noah. Yes, Noah. Wow. <laughs> okay, I don't have to vote. Good job, Noah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm just, I'm just saying, okay, I could have come up with a sob story, but I guess no, I, I said awesome. I'll just give it to I charity. Mean, to be fair, you said, yes. I don't Did need you the money. I, I, no, I the did. thing is, okay. I was going to give it to charity, but great. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank you. Y'all give it up for Noah. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Woo, that was intense a little bit. So what if you like taught us a quick dance and then you picked who did it the best? Is that okay that I get immunity? Yeah, I don't care. I don't well, mind. I think you should do the dance too, right? If I'm teaching the dance, I'm gonna do it the best. Yeah. <laughs> well, then it sounds like our couch is deciding who does it oh, best. Oh. I guess I can decide. <laughs> He's gonna vote. He can decide. Who's the worst? Who's the worst? Yes. Yeah, the at, the dance. Dance. at the dance. That we get taught by coach. You'll never know if it's actually the one who's the worst. <laughs> True. <laughs> so you're gonna hit your right elbow twice to go. One, two, and then hit your elbow twice to go. Three, four. We got that? Yeah. Your right leg is gonna step up and you're gonna open up to go five and six. Your right leg is just gonna turn to go seven and eight. Oh, I hit you, I'm so sorry. All, right. All together, 
Noah's favorite. Noah decides who goes, right? Yeah. Yes. And we're basing that off of who Noah dislikes the most. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, switch, three, four, open, five, and six, turn seven, Janet, eight. Damn, I'm gonna lose this round. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. I, I forgot the name of you're the long hair guy. Oh my god. I think your moves were like the slowest out of everyone. Everyone else put a lot more hip into it. So are you eliminating Scott? Sorry. <laughs> oh, it's fine. Oh, yeah. it's oh thanks. Yeah. Uh, how do you feel? How do you feel, Scott? Oh, I'm fine. It's okay. I never got to see Scott do the dance. Because he was he was like being a wallflower in the back. That's that's what I said. I'm gonna start the round. Do you have any suggestions on what we should do? Something gay. A fun yeah. gay game. Never, never, never. What was it? Spicy. Never, never, never. never. I think we just <laughs> lie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who here do you think is the most prude? I think Christopher is the prudest. I, I think, think I'm the prude. Yeah. <laughs> Whoever wins, we're gonna have them pick who goes home. Never have I ever been to Europe. Never ever have I sucked two dicks in one day. <laughs> Oh no. He is not the prude. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> I thought he was the prude. Um, never have I ever done a threesome before. <laughs> it's getting sexual. Never have I ever crashed my car in total day. I don't... Oh, actually, I did. Uh, oh my god. So, <laughs> so your finger's down then? Yeah, my finger's down. Never ever have I had sex with a girl. Did anyone go down for that? No. no. Wow, well, we're all we're gold. Are we on yeah. golden games? Yeah, we're gold oh, star gay. gay. Wait, but are you a gold star gay or a platinum gay? I was a platinum. Wait, what's platinum. the difference? So gold star gay means that you've never had sex with a woman. Okay. Platinum gay means that you were delivered by C-section. So you've literally never touched a vagina in your life. Yeah. Oh. 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 I wish platinum. I was fucking platinum. <laughs> <laughs> never have I ever thrown up while being drunk. Mm. <laughs> never have I ever like spit in someone's mouth for like sexual gratitude. Purposes. <laughs> No, no fingers. Never have I ever had friends with benefits. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> yes. um, oh, my fingers went down. Okay, well. quick. Never ever have I owned a dog. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was very smart. Coach, you oh. have the most. And then they both have one. Who went out? These two went out. Oh. So coach gets to pick who goes. Dang. <laughs> Who's your biggest threat here? Coach and a threat. <laughs> <laughs> whoever has the softest hands. We gotta get rid of him next. Coach wants to do whoever has the softest hands gets eliminated. I'm like, come on, I work in a bar. <laughs> oh my god, this is ridiculous. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um, Christopher. Christopher. Uh. Okay. Oh, uh, oh, the 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 nice <laughs> knowing you. Yeah. Do <laughs> yeah. Yes. So one more elimination round. So we got to be careful. I'm gonna start right now. You think there's a leader? Yes. Yeah, that's definitely. Working. He's so charismatic, though. What y'all talking about over there? Who might be the leader of the group? <laughs> <laughs> you have that star quality, obviously. I have so. not given one idea about how we play the game. Just to be clear. Not making a decision is a decision. Uh-oh. I'm targeted. <laughs> How should we vote? Like in a flashcard or something? Yeah, we'll just do that then. So far, who do you think won okay. out of the four people out there? So I haven't decided if I'm going by survivor rules, like who's the strongest, in which case obviously it's coach. Or should I just give it to um, the guy who wants to be a drag queen just because he's going to bring more joy into the world? I don't know. Medical bills are expensive and it's like part of your health. We were gonna have you guys uh, read them and then just say it. it's gonna be anonymous, they said. Do you want them to read? Yeah, yeah. we're gonna have the couch Let's read Let's have them. the couch. Thank you. I wonder what their reasons oh. were. I know. Why did my stomach just get a little <laughs> queasy? <gasps> okay. Hello. The first vote goes to Rod. Second vote goes to Joey. Third vote goes to Rod. And the last vote goes to Coach. Oh. So Rod got two. Rod. Rod. Oh, oh we're going gonna miss you, Rod. Of course. <laughs> I was going to vote oh. for you to win. Oh. I know, say. Nobody voted for you, Felix. I know, I've seen that. I was like, thank okay, you, bye. guys. I appreciate that. You're the favorite. Why Rod? Yeah, who voted for Rod? I voted for Rod. 
I'm gonna be honest. The reason I had voted for you is because you have a lot of time to develop as a drag queen. I just have to say, I did write down your name at first and then I crossed it out. So then who did you switch it to? To Coach. Why Coach? Coach walking in here with a Louis Vuitton bag. Oh my god. Oh. 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 And then the oh. You do be popping off with it, but like, damn. Joey, somebody voted for you. Yeah, someone voted for me, and I know they voted for Rod, which means Rod <laughs> voted for me. I voted for you literally because I ran out of ideas. It was literally the first name that came to my mind. The final round, the couch decides who wins. The way I coach, I mean, you pick some really shitty ways to decide who should get eliminated. He yeah, those hands and whatnot, good. and you basically dominated everything, but I still will vote for you because it was your show. <laughs> Do y'all feel like I dominated it? No. I don't feel like you, I mean like, yeah, kind of, but not like in a <laughs> negative way. Like it was yes. like, you were the voice, like period. Like, like I can respect you. that. That's so crazy because I literally said I wasn't going to do that when I walked in here. I personally don't feel like it was a bad thing. I thought I was so quiet. When I think of the people on the couch who like a thousand dollars would impact their life the most or like whatnot, I think Felix. I really appreciate that. I think I'm mostly stuck between Felix and Joey. But like, again, does it have to be like, who needs the money? That, that was my point from the very beginning, right? If that was the case, then I should have gotten the money because I'm giving it to homeless people. Like, I no. keep hearing you say, Noah, that you should have lied and came in with a sob story. You're fine, you're financially stable right now, but sure, not a lot yeah. of people are. So saying that type of stuff, like I should have came in with a sob story is kind of like invalidating the people who do kind of have one. No, actually, I'm not invalidating your stories. Everyone's stories are valid. There's so many other stories that we are not seeing just because they're not in this room. Exactly. Do you guys deserve the $1,000 more than the stories that we're not even seeing out there, mm -hmm. you know? I was gonna vote for Felix as well. Thank you. Uh, mental health is very important for me. I would like to <laughs> vote Honestly, based yeah. on just our own yeah. preferences. What's happening? We're all gonna vote based on how we wanna vote individually. Um, and then yeah. whoever has the most votes wins. Yeah. And it seems like it is Felix. It is Felix, yeah. Oh my goodness. Yay! <laughs> Thank you guys. Was this how you all expected this to go? Better than I expected. Better. <laughs> I think it was way better than Actually, I really good vibes. I just wanna say, I don't have a lot of queer people in my life, so the fact that I'm experiencing all of this right now. It makes me feel warm about my identity and like how I feel and like my dreams and all that. So I appreciate all of you for that. Yeah. Yeah. Any other takeaways for folks? I have soft hands. <laughs> <laughs>